Time for some silver. I've been tasked with remaking this as well as another one. The other part to this earring set has been lost. And a nice lovely lady wants these made in sterling silver instead of stainless steel. So I'm going to do what I can to recreate this interesting caricature and possibly give it a little bit more detail. But first, I'm going to start with a casting. This is going to be my supply. I'm not sure how much this would weigh in silver, but what I'm going to do is, because this is a failed bar, I'm just going to cut it in half and use it that way. Anything extra that comes off the sprue is always going to get reused, so I'm not too worried about it. Let's get our mold set up. I think that should work. It's a little uh, off on the impressions, but that's okay. I'm good with that. Let's uh, put them back together, pour some metal in. A little half bar, a half a piece out of that bar was perfect. Let's see how good this turned out. Yeah. Not bad. A lot of cleanup, but I'm okay with that. Now I gotta make one more. One more time around might do it. yeah much better quite a bit more cleanup than the uh, the first one I did I'm all right with that cool now we can uh, get to cutting the sprues off this little bit right here and the one at the top and then we can start cleaning it up figuring out what kind of detail needs to be added into it but the copy from the original is complete let's get to the uh, time-consuming part Eh, 
right about half done but I'm happy with them I'm gonna leave it at this for now because there's quite a bit more cleanup and filing I have to do I did one round of Tripoli on it to give it a little bit more shine and show me what spots I missed with the cleanup but they're not too bad the reason I'm gonna leave them half done is I want to check and see what kind of detail is going to be wanted or added to it if any but I say that's not bad from the original yeah I could deal with that for now on to the next one